Hi, I'm Francois. Welcome to the channel. In today's video, we're making the most powerful sound for melodic techno, melodic house. And the great thing is, it's also the easiest sound. I'm creating a new MIDI channel and we need the plugin Diva. So I'm going to plugins, picking up an instance of Diva, loading it up here. And this is the init patch from Diva. If I'm playing a chord on my MIDI keyboard, this is what it sounds like. It's a great sound. So let's quickly load up a chord progression for that sound and play it. It's a saw wave generated by oscillator 2, put all the way up in this mixer here and then run through a low pass filter, 24 decibels per octave, with this envelope applied and at the end we are putting a plate reverb on top of the sound. So it's a very straightforward sound and coming out of Diva, it sounds fantastic. And right here with this init sound, we just need to make like three adjustments. This lag parameter, which is an envelope controlling the filter, goes to three o'clock, so the sound doesn't open up as much. And we get this nice vibes pad going, a bit more sustain on the sound. Nice, and just the cutoff down a little further. And you could mess around with the glide setting here, so it's pitched in the beginning. If you like that, I'm taking it down a bit further. Okay, so there's our pad sound. What a nice sound. And let's just copy the whole track to make a melody. I'm quickly loading up a melody. Solo this one. This is still the pad sound. It's a little bit too laggy. So let's go over to this control here. And instead of lag, select envelope 2, which is this one here. Bring down the glide. And over here where it says effect 1, select delay 1 and activate it. So we have a nice delay on that sound and bring down the sustain to 11 o'clock and decay as well. Now we have a nice plucky melody sound and let's play it together. Perfect sound for starting a melodic house track. If you want to start a melodic techno track, put in a bit of noise with this noise parameter here. Okay, let's actually put in a bass sound as well. So another copy of this pad sound, which was made of the init patch and just load up the bass notes quickly. So we have this. Taking off the low cut. And we just need to take off the plate reverb effect from this patch. There we go. There's our bass. Let's play it together. So there's our starting point for a nice track and we just use the Diva in it patch. Let's put in a kick sample quickly here from our brand new The Premium Volume 5 drum sample pack. And a nice deep clap sound. And a shaker loop. And a percussive loop.
And you can obviously go further and shape that sound further. If you don't want to play a saw wave, which is the waveform that's activated here, you can turn it into a square wave. and mess around with the parameters and shape your sound. But how great is this Diva init patch? You can just get started and you have an idea for a song right there. So I hope you enjoyed this little sound session on Diva. Feel free to check out the links in the description. We have nice preset packs for Diva. We have a full sound design course for Diva where you can learn this synth from the inside out, what all these parameters doing and how to shape the sounds that you envision in your mind for your tracks. Also, we have full start to finish courses on how to make melodic house tracks, melodic techno tracks completely from scratch in Ableton and courses on how to write chords and melodies. So feel free to check that out. Leave a comment and a like, subscribe to this channel and I hope to see you next time.